Hey YouTube, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to read deleted WhatsApp messages. What we're gonna be downloading here today is actually an app called, um, let's get on there, WhatsApp Saver. And basically it's gonna save every message that comes into your WhatsApp. Um, and basically, so if they send you the message, then delete it, you're actually gonna get the uh, message saved. Um, so let me go ahead and open up some, uh, I just set myself uh, WhatsApp message with another account, just made it say <laughs> Dwight Troop. And as you guys can see, it says this message has been deleted. I've deleted the messages. Um, and yeah, all on my other phone, I guess, delete the messages. This message has been deleted. And now when I go into the WhatsApp saver application, um, it's gonna actually show me all the messages of what I actually said there. So I'm gonna go ahead, show you guys how to get this, how to install this. It's gonna be completely free um, to install. And basically you're gonna be able to read um, every single WhatsApp message that's been deleted or video. It's gonna save that with the WhatsApp Saver app. So let me go ahead and actually um, start screen recording and show you guys how to do this. Um, it literally won't take too long at all. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. So let me just go put on my um, screen recorder right now. All right, and as you guys can see, we have that WhatsApp saver app. So I'm gonna go ahead and delete that right now. So we're gonna delete it, and we're gonna go ahead and fully install it here today. So if you're on iPhone, of course this works on Android as well, but if you're on iPhone, you wanna to go to settings, and we're gonna to go to general. We're gonna go down to background app refresh, okay? And you wanna make sure this is turned on. This will allow you to actually um, let the app install and get it on your device. So we're gonna make sure we have that. And that will basically run the WhatsApp saver app in the background while you've got WhatsApp open, so you can read those deleted messages. Next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and actually install that application. So we're gonna go to Safari, and we're gonna go to this website here called ZTweak. It's spelled Z-E-E-T-W-E-A-K.com, ZTweak. Looks like that, obviously it's on the screen. Um, so type that in, .com, Z tweak, double Z, sorry, Z double E, tweak.com. And you want to go to search and just type in what's app and you're going to see what's app saver. So go ahead and press install. It's going to say what's app saver, read and save deleted WhatsApp messages. So we're going to press install. And what that's going to do is basically install the app to our device. Um, and then we can go ahead and use it and run it um, and, and read those deleted WhatsApp messages. So yeah, it won't take too long guys, nice and quick. As you guys can see, it's just downloading it. And like I said, this does work on both iOS and Android. So super easy, completely for free, takes about a couple of minutes and you can you know read messages that people delete. It's kind of toxic, why do people deleting messages? Stupid. Uh, but yeah, this is gonna save it for that. Alrighty, so as you guys can see, it's gonna say this website is trying to download a profile. Do you wanna allow this? We press allow and then we press close. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to settings on our iPhone, okay? And we're gonna to go to general. You're gonna scroll down until you see VPN and device management. Now if it says VPN and device management, that is gonna um, simply uh, show you there. Now it is different for every different iOS device. Sometimes it's gonna say VPN, sometimes it's gonna say profiles. If it says profiles, click on that. But new iOS is gonna say VPN and device management. And you're gonna see download a profile, the WhatsApp saver. So click on that and then press install. Type in your passcode, press next, press install, install, done. And now you have the WhatsApp saver app installed in your device. And now you can go ahead and actually do this. So it really is that easy, guys, to read deleted uh, messages on WhatsApp. You can now open this up and it's going to save every message um, when it comes in um, locally. Um, and you can save them to iCloud as well if you need to do that. Um, but WhatsApp Saver is the app and it's as simple as that. So thanks so much for watching, guys. If you need any help, drop a comment below and I can help you guys out. Thanks so much. Peace out.